November 5, 1872, a defiant vote. In Rochester, New York, Susan B. Anthony, a leading figure in the women's suffrage movement, cast a ballot in the presidential election, challenging the prevailing laws that restricted voting rights to men. Prior to this act, Anthony and 14 other women had successfully registered to vote, citing the recently adopted 14th Amendment, which they interpreted as granting them citizenship rights, including suffrage. Their registration was met with resistance. However, after persistent argumentation, the election inspectors allowed them to proceed. Anthony voted for the incumbent, President Ulysses S. Grant. Subsequently, on November 18, 1872, she was arrested by a U.S. deputy marshal and charged with voting illegally. Her trial commenced on June 17, 1873, in Canandaigua, New York, presided over by Justice Ward Hunt. Despite Anthony's defense that the 14th Amendment conferred upon her the right to vote, Justice Hunt directed the jury to deliver a guilty verdict without deliberation. Anthony was fined $100, a sum she steadfastly refused to pay, stating, I shall never pay a dollar of your unjust penalty. This act of civil disobedience underscored the systemic denial of women's rights and galvanized the suffrage movement, contributing to the eventual ratification of the 19th Amendment in 1920, which granted women the constitutional right to vote. For enthusiasts of historical ephemera, visit history-collectors.com to find collectibles that might complement your collection. You can own a piece of history.